Yo yo guys and girls, this is Chaotic here. This is going to be my second video on my nomination for Game of the Year 2015. I will put my nomination one link in the description or actually on the video in case you want to have a look. This is Fallout 4, which was released November the 10th, 2015. Um, as you can see here, I've actually taken over the settlement. Okay. There was a few raiders who were actually in possession of the settlement. So I killed the raiders. Uh, you'll be able to see them on the floor there. There's, a, there's one of them. There's a couple more that little debate. You can take whatever, whatever you need from what they're carrying. And the scary big dude that you see hey. following me around is my companion, that's strong. He fights with me. You sure was strong. And he's quite a good tank. You can also carry things for you. When you when you're at your maximum um, carry weight. You can give him various different weapons and different uh, guns. So yeah, this settlement was already made. I didn't have to start from scratch, which was good. Um, on the map here, I'm looking for a place called Spectacle Island that I haven't discovered yet. I believe it's by here. And apparently there's a bobblehead, a luck bobblehead, which will increase your luck by a whole skill point. So I'm going to attempt to get to Spectacle Island and try and find the bobblehead. There's a few collectible bobbleheads scattered around the vast world of Fallout 4 and if you find them like I say they give you a attribute increase on various different skills and uh, skill trees that you are unlocking so I'm going to try and make it put a little marker now so I know where I'm going on Spectacle Island This is just like an. I'm just exploring here, you know. There's, there's quest lines you can follow. You know, you, you can just walk around and explore if you like, which I like doing. It's not everyone's cup of tea. Some people like it just to follow the quests. But I like just to walk around and discover new places. There's loads of places to visit and find. Yeah, I just discovered Shaw High School now, basically. I can fast travel to that there, now I've discovered it. And the things you see me picking up, if they've got a little magnifying glass next to the item, it means I need it. I've marked it as I need it. Uh, you'll see when you get your settlement. You need various different um, resources to build different items for your settlements. You can put uh, turrets up and build beds and oh, you can do all sorts so yeah you need to have a little look around and salvage wherever you can basically so yeah it's getting dark now so you've got to be aware of your surroundings but yeah thoughts on Fallout 4 so far very good game if you like Fallout 3 or New Vegas, you'll absolutely adore Fallout 4. If you didn't like Fallout 3, I'd tell you to you know, have a look at it first because it may not be your cup of tea, but I enjoyed Fallout 3 and Fallout uh, New Vegas. These little things scattered around the map you can find, these, these little treasures. you to discover. I've got a perk on which will allow me to go in the water. Um, before you have the perk I believe you get a lot of radiation. You know, I've got a small amount of radiation there. But without the perk I think you get a lot of radiation a lot quicker. So. I'm taking my time just to scope out the area for you. You can run in if you like, but uh, you got to watch you don't get surrounded. Let's 
set in a post-apocalyptic Boston, Fallout 4. It's set in the year 2287, I believe, so we're quite a far ahead in the future. And here we go, here come the ghouls. As you'll see, aim for the legs with the ghouls. They stop them running at you and charging. And take their legs. Because otherwise you can get surrounded by them. They're quite quick, as you'll see. Uh, I don't know where <laughs> Strong's going. It looks like he's swimming around to go and get him. So I'm retreating a bit. I'm gonna pick my pick, pick their legs. There you are. They'll, they'll just crawl towards you now, which gives you a bit of time. You know, you can go for the heads, but uh, I, I find with the goals it's great to slow them down. As you'll see, they are quite quick, and they will gain gain ground quite quick. You know, the more armoured foes, it's not as easy to um, cripple their legs. I'm trying to keep the light behind me, yep, I knew there's one coming. You get all sorts of foes, you get stuff from ghouls to raiders, and then you get some nasty, nasty creatures out in the, in the wasteland. Some very, very strong and very durable opponents. You can put quite a lot of guns in your shortcuts, I believe. Something like 12 guns, I think you can have. You'll see in a, in a bit, but at the moment I'm just using one of my hunting rifles. Yeah, I got a bit of radiation damage because they actually uh, <laughs> squirted their blood all over me. Well, up here, strong. Come and give me a hand. Watch him now. Boosh. He's quite uh, deadly with his. Uh, Sledgehammer. Always go around and loot. And like I say, if you've marked stuff that you need it, you'll see a little magnifying glass next to it. So of course, pick pick up anything you you've marked as you need, like the red plate there. And you can build a lot of things in your settlement. So yeah, follow the quest or just explore, you know, the world is your oyster on Fallout 4. You you play the game how you want to play it. You can totally ignore the quest and just explore. Be careful, all the further down the map you go, the bigger and badder some of these uh, foes are. And you do get a lot of XP from doing the quests, so... Um, I would say to you to do a few of the quests, you get some good rewards, some good weapons and armour, and there's a lot of good armour out there. You can use uh, the power suit as well, which makes you a lot stronger. Oh, there's, a <laughs> there's a little mine on the floor, and the ghoul must have followed me in, and they blew the ghoul up, or blew his leg off. Strong's there to finish. Yeah, sure, companion, you can um, order in around the map, you can tell them to stay, to follow you, to attack and there's many many different followers, you can have, you can have a, a dog called dog meat, strong, people with guns but yeah I like strong following me, he's good he's with, with a bit of armour on him, he's quite strong I've changed my gun now, I'm going to use a little handgun, see how I get on So let's try and get Spectacle Island. Bottle cap mine, very strong, very, very strong. We put a bottle cap mine down and lure something into it. So, yeah, Fallout 4 is my second nomination for Game of the Year. I will do one more. So keep your eyes peeled on my um, channel. And I'll get uh, nomination number three up before the end of the year. I've got three very good games to hey, nominate. Over here. You're yeah, I'm telling Strong to come over here. Give me a bit of backup. So I'll leave you with some gameplay now folks.
And I would say to you, if you get a chance, give Fallout 4 a go. There's tons to do. And you can play it in different ways. You can go melee. You can use baseball bats. You can upgrade. Yeah, I'm, I'm free firing there. You don't have to use the bat. The bats is when you aim down the site and pick the specific parts of the body. Strong's getting a little bit um, surrounded there, so I'm going to try and give him a hand. Oh, Strong's down. When you see him down like this, you've got to, you can either go up and give him a stim pack, which is like your med, your med kit. But obviously he uses up one of your stim packs then, or you can wait and he'll recover and come back to help you when he's fit. Because there's no enemies around, he's recovered quite quickly there. Uh, so he's not going to actually die, but he'll, he will go down and he will take a time out. So yes folks, thanks for watching and enjoy the rest of the video. Peace out.
enemies. Go check that out. Strong can do that. Check it out. Will do. Here I come. I win again. Heads up. Take a look.
Hey. Move here. over there. Heads up. Need strong to smash something. Got a second, big guy? Take meat. Make humans strong. How do you think humans things are? Humans like Twitch? other humans. Smart, but weak. Strong stay with human for now. Up. Strong listening. Strong can carry a lot. And there you have it guys, there's a luck bobblehead that I was searching for that will uh, raise my luck level a whole point. Finally got it, but it was well worth uh, the fight and the searching. Hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, like, comment and subscribe. Cheers guys.